Freedom back? Answer my question. What happened out there on the terrace? All right. I'll tell you. You get out of Annie up in that room, we'll be inadmissible. All you'll have on your hands is a kidnapping charge, Zach. You need something you can use in court. I'm not looking for anything to use in court, Jesse. What are you looking for? What are you trying to do? I want to break Annie. And if Aiden does his job, she will tell the truth to anyone who will listen. All I wanted was my daughter. My beautiful Emma. I didn't mean for anybody to get hurt. Wrong. It wasn't supposed to happen like this. I didn't want to tie you up. I didn't want to hurt you. You were, you were helping me. You were trying to get me out of the country before I got caught. And you were amazing. But you wanted me to leave without Emma. And I couldn't do that. But you're right. You're so right. I just should have listened to you. If I listened to you, we could have lived this perfect life. It could have been you, me, and Emma forever. Now you're just playing games with me, Annie. You broke the rule. And you're making me very angry. Annie cost my wife everything. It ends tonight. I believed in Kendall's innocence, which is why I agreed to keep her here instead of sending her to prison. I know what it's like to be separated from your family without having done anything wrong. But this is not part of the plan. Jesse, we didn't know it would come to this. All right, Chief. Why don't you go up there, kick the door in, and protect Annie from what she deserves? Huh? Go up there, do the right thing. Please untie me. All I want is for you to follow the rule. Answer my questions and tell me the truth. I am telling you the truth. Aiden, I loved you. <laughs> but you had done everything that you could. You saved me from Sinclair, from Oakhaven. Why don't we just get I... to the truth already? Huh? Let's just stop messing around and just tell me the truth. Then I'll let you go free. You left me down there in that cellar and then you went on a mission. Aiden, once you fell down those stairs, I knew what I had to do. There was no turning back. That night on the terrace, you did it, didn't you? You killed Stuart. Yes. Yes, I did. I had to get Emma out of that house. But Stuart got in my way. So I shot him. And I used drugged up Adam as my alibi. Oh. Well, isn't that what you wanted to hear? Fine, tell me what you want to hear and I will say it. I just have to get out of this room and I have to go see my daughter. I see. Let it play itself out. Hubbard, anything on Annie? Um, no. Annie has not been seen at the airports or the bus stations, but I'm guessing she's still in town. You gotta find her, Jesse, now. What happened? Emma is ready to tell me the truth about the secret that Annie made her keep, except that she wants to talk to her first. Ryan, you know I'll do everything I can to find her. Just keep Emma talking. Maybe she'll open up anyway. What is it? What happened? Well, things just got one hell of a lot more complicated. What the hell do you want from me? I told you I did it. Well, I'll say anything you want me to say. Please just untie time you take me to Annie, my daughter, Aiden. You know what I want, all right? I want the truth. And you're not leaving here until I get to I it. can't. Don't you understand? No, I don't get it. I don't understand. So why don't you explain it to me? Please. Please, if you ever cared about me, if what we had ever meant anything, you will take me to see Emma. I just have to be with my daughter right now. Why? Why do you have to go and see Emma now? Because I told her 
to tell anyone the truth. I made her promise me. And because she loves me, she's going to keep that promise. And it is tearing her up inside. And I have to go tell her that she doesn't have to do that anymore. Please, Aiden, take me to my daughter. Emma, we've always thought she was the key to this, so we're close. Well, let's not get our hopes up just yet. She might be ready to talk, but not without her mother there. And Annie. Annie. Unpredictable Annie. Who knows? Hello, Chief. Fancy seeing you here. Yeah. Right. He knows what's been going on up there. So what did she say? Did you get anything out of her? Even more important, what did you do to her? I didn't lay a hand on her. Okay, but I did make some progress. She confessed? Well, not in the way we want. And he's willing to say anything in order to see Emma. So she told me that she did it. But maybe it's just a ploy to get out of there. So what progress did you make? I got Annie to admit that Emma's keeping a big secret about what happened that night. And she made Emma promise not to tell anyone whatever that secret is. Oh, and she feels guilty now for what she put Emma through. Oh, well, it's about time. And she wants Emma to know that it's okay to tell. And she will tell, but not without her mother. So what are we waiting for? If all Annie wants in order to tell us the truth is to see Emma and talk to her, let's get these two together. We're not going to do it here. Too many people know about our secret room. So far, I'm the only one Annie knows is involved. I could sedate her, and then we could take her anywhere. Would you listen to what you're saying? What? You kidnapped this woman. You took her upstairs and did God only knows what to her. Now you're talking about drugging her up, dropping her off for a play date with her daughter. You think she's going to keep quiet about that? No. And hey, why don't we just bring Ryan in on We're this? We're going to tell Ryan just enough so he can get us what we need.